Yo, what's up, guys? Demonator and I'm here, and we're back. Today, uh, blah, 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 blah. I'm just kidding. Um, so, um, I just want to make an update video on my uh, the how to install mods for Magic Launcher. I mean, Minecraft 1.6.2. Uh, there's been a little problem here and there for some people, so I decided to uh, you know, make a try to install everything again. So I downloaded everything, refreshed like everything, like the newest version. So I have it all, I've already downloaded all of it, so it's going to be in my mod folder. I did that ahead so you guys didn't have to wait. So all these mods I just downloaded today at um, 4.05, see it's how it's 4.30, so I was testing if some of them worked. So let's just go real fast to my, the most important one. This is my video that, I've all, that, that I'm going to make an update. Um, just go to Forge, right there. Actually, hold up, why? Why, why are you doing this, computer? Save. Okay, so we're gonna go to Forge, and we're gonna download the first one that you see. So the 844 installer. Once you download that, something like this should pop up, like that. Minecraft installer. So once you um, you're gonna click it twice, and then this should pop up. And you're gonna try. You're gonna do install client now. See how it's. 844 yeah now it might take a little while it took me a, a bit but um yeah so once you get that you're gonna go to let me just do it for you guys so set app data percent then go all the way down well for me down and go to versions and then this should appear right here so um uh, a few comments said uh if you press if you made all the steps like other videos of making your own and if you press control f you would find the id this is true, however, let's see, control F, and if you go ID, it is down there. See? The only problem here is that I have not, I, it hasn't worked for me, like I renamed it and everything, and it didn't work. So we're just going to leave it like that, how it is. So what you're going to do is you're going to want to um, uh, install Magic Launcher, but before we it, but bef before we do that, once you install that uh, for Forge client, you're going to go to regular Minecraft open it because you have to do this you're gonna go to edit profile and down here where it says release try it's gonna be the bottom one it's gonna be this one the forge and press save profile now you're gonna press press play this is just gonna load up some stuff and you know let's, let's hope it works I think it'll work it's working it's working man and cool we got it installed so yeah and awesome now what we're gonna want to do is gonna go to magic launcher and once we're in there, just top in your stuff, default and all that. Okay, right. Before actually, before we go into stuff, go to advanced and put in this code. I'm gonna uh, paste it in the. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! <laughs> uh, you know what? Yolo, yolo. I don't care. So that was right here is gonna be my um some stuff I'm gonna put in the description. That you're not supposed to see, but uh, not enough stuff appeared, so. So you're gonna um, want to copy this right here. Once you copy that, uh, it'll be in the description. You're gonna put it in advanced and parameters. So once you're there, go back to mods, find Forge in, in environments, and click it. Now what you're gonna do is put all your mods in one folder. This folder is where Magic Launcher is gonna get your mods. So I have it uh, in my stuff in my folder. So let's go to add go to desktop my stuff mod folder mods and they're all right here you're not gonna want you're not gonna want to install oh it's not even here oh this one you're not gonna want to install it also the code was for optifine i don't know if it'll work without the code or not because i haven't tried that out but i just put it in just in case so just put it in your mod now so open add open so yeah, you're just gonna um, <coughs> add all of these. Camera uh, break, and then last but not least, Optifine. So for some of you, status might say Forge not found. Don't worry about that. That has ha that happened to me the first time I was going through this. It doesn't really mean anything until you uh, log in. Once you log in, it it'll mean it'll say okay. So yeah, you're kind of just done here. So you're gonna press OK, and you're ready to go. So just to make sure you got all your mods, you got the code thing here, and yeah. So we're gonna press OK, log in. 
and it should be going. Should be going soon. Cool, cool. It's going. So now I have free time for it to load. I just want to say sorry about the resolution. I'm using one of those old ass. Oh, th that's gross. This gross. Hold up, guys. It's gross. <laughs> Hold up. Uh, me normal. There we go. That look okay. So sorry for the resolution. I'm using one of those old square monitors, and it's, bleh, it's gross. So you can see eight mods out of eight, and they're all right here. So cool. So we're gonna test it and see if it'll work. So just uh, this is the server that I play on. So actually, let's go to Killian.EvolutionGaming.org. See if it's on. Please be on. Okay, cool. It's on. And we're here. Oh my god, there's a lot of sides. Oh my god. So, let me just change some stuff really fast because I don't like, I like my inventory to be I and that to be E. Don't judge my thing like that. And cool. Okay, now we're going to see if it'll work. So, I'm going to go open one of my stuff that I have. Just take some diamonds. And bottom left, it says 24 diamonds. So, that means it'll work. If you guys don't trust me, I'll put on some armor really quick. Uh, bottom left, you can see that it um, it shows you the armor and all the percentages it has. So yeah, pretty cool. So that that is part of the armor status mod, and uh, status effect mod is for potions. Uh, let's just test it out. I don't really care. Bottom left, it'll show you. No wait. Oh, uh, over there on the right, it'll show you what you have and how much time you have left. So yeah, so you can see like this works awesome. It works cool. Um, um, Optifine works. Raise minimap works. So yeah, really quick. I'm just gonna show you how to uh, fix your uh, how to for armor status. Oh, wrong thing. For armor status mod, how to arrange your thing where you want it. So you're just gonna go to percent app data percent. Gonna go to Minecraft and where it says mod, I think. Nope, not mod. Not mod. Uh, config. It was config. You're gonna go to uh, this one. The armor status and the status effect mod. So the armor status for the, your armor, and you're gonna go to alignment mod. So you're gonna go for me. I like top left, and you're gonna save it. Cool. And now for your status effect mod, you're gonna go right here, and I like mine to be what was it? Bottom right save awesome so now it should work let's go try it again I don't care I don't really don't care if it's loading <laughs> and kablam it's working I hope yeah it's working go to killing again gonna show you guys so cause I logged off with the potion it should still be there so yeah my potion thing is on the bottom right uh, and where my item shows on the top left cool and yeah I think that's kind of it uh, really fast guys I just want to say I'm sorry for the resolution again um, using one of those square monitors it looks ugly as poop um, also want to say sorry for the noise as well my mic still has that staticky sound and you know that's I don't know how to fix it so sorry about that and yeah hope you guys liked uh, the video uh, if you did please leave a like yeah <laughs> and subscribe if you haven't done so it'll mean a lot to me and stay tuned cuz I think I'm gonna be posting more more stuff so yeah peace out guys